oh, this is kind of weird to explain, but I have heart-shaped nostrils. So they're small and then they go big and small and then big. I can't believe I'm doing this here. What's going on, SiriusXM? It's Henry here. I'm going to highlight some iconic moments from my career. I'm a big fan of uh, Michael Buble. One time I was in Italy, and then at the hotel, this guy walks in, and nobody's really paying much attention to him. And I'm like, and I stood right up. I was like, hi, I'm Henry Lau. I do this and this, and I'm a big fan of you. And we ended up eating breakfast for two hours together and we're just talking about music it was just an amazing experience because you know like when you meet somebody that that means so much to you and then it turns out they're just amazing people the time that one of my songs went viral i had this one song where i kind of wrote as a joke on korean tv and it went <laughs> I know you guys probably don't understand, but that's uh, it's it's kind of like like kind of wrong Korean. A song that I was messing around with, and everyone was just like listening to it. So it's amazing moment when somebody stopped me on the street. I mean, I have heart shaped nostrils. I showed that to to people on TV, and then somebody was on the street was like, "Hey!" And then she wanted a selfie with my heart shaped nostrils. So they're small, and then they go big, and small, and then big. I can't believe I'm doing this here. I feel like we're talking about this a little too much, yeah. One of the moments my one of my videos went viral. In my music, a lot of my performances, I use a lot of different instruments and I loop them all together, layer them together and stuff like that. One time I decided to go to a factory, a huge factory in Korea. And I like used everything, like steel sticks, I used bins, and I just, I just made it into this one performance. At the time, I didn't think it would work out so well, but then, you know, next thing I knew when it when it aired, it went viral and, and uh, yeah, that was, that, was, that was an amazing moment. When a fan gave me something weird or unique. Oh, somebody. I got a book one time. I didn't know you could do this, but you could buy constellations. And somebody bought me a, a constellation somewhere. And they named it Henry. So, yeah, that's pretty, pretty cool, huh? When I could not learn a new instrument. I'm pretty confident with this one, but if you give me an instrument for at least like one hour, I'd probably get it. Damn, am I sounding too cocky here? No. Oh. No, I got that one too. No, there's this instrument where you gotta use your hand to like use the, the, your hand to like control the notes. And I couldn't get it at first, but I got it. The instrument you're looking for is the theremin, by the way. <laughs> the voice is serious. Uh, Sirius XM has spoken. The, the the theremin you said? Yeah, um, the theremin. So I was playing the theremin and I couldn't get in the beginning, but I, I got it after a while. I travel a lot. Um, I, I mean, at times, like I actually like don't know where 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 I am. We we're f filming some some stuff on a boat. At one point, I was like, Yo, where are we? Hey everyone, it's Henry here. Uh, I just had a great time with Sirius XM, highlighting some of my iconic moments of my career. Uh, I just released a, a new song called. Real Love Still Exists, please check that out. And after you check that one out, check my last one out too, called Moonlight. Uh, thank you guys.